so a uh, postdoc fellow uh, at the <coughs> Excellence Cluster Tupoi of the Free University of uh, Berlin. And what I'd like to introduce now is the uh, <coughs> results of the uh, project I conduct, is my uh, PhD project on uh, Wrocław University uh, in, the, uh, in the Geography uh, Institute. Uh, the, this project was a part of, uh, of my grant project financed by the, by the Ministry of uh, Higher uh, Education. It's about uh, the trial to, to uh, simulate the uh, processes, settlement processes of the Latin culture in, in, in Upper Silesia to, to, uh, to answer the questions that, that are brought with the with some uh, theories and hypotheses uh, concerning the, the whole process. Uh, in Poland, there are uh, four groups of uh, Celtic settlements. The two, the uh, Lower Silesian and Upper Silesian is considered as a, uh, let's say, uh, clean Celtic uh, settlements, and the other two are more mixed with the uh, Germanic tribes. Uh, so this is the upper Silesian uh, Latin culture group. Uh, on this slide, we can see that the, the presence of the Latin culture settlement in this area uh, consisted were, were to take place for more than 200 years. And uh, when the time I was doing this research, I had a evidence of 399 settlement points uh, of this nine burial sites. Uh, only uh, two, uh, 133 points had an accurate uh, position in, in, in space. The rest uh, has more or less approximate uh, position. Uh, and this is pretty uh, frustrating, but I tried to solve this uh, problem a little bit. Uh, as a structure of the, of the settlement, we can see that it, it has uh, three clusters, let's say, or more dense uh, settlement areas, which uh, pictures the kernel density map. This is just uh, for, uh, for uh, having this um, experience, how, 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 how does it uh, look like. Uh, so, background. Um, uh, the majority of uh, settlement points comes from the uh, phase C of, of uh, the Latin period, so not from the beginning. Uh, this is one remark needed that the, the total majority of uh, information about the settlement points comes from the fieldworks only. And there are very few dated uh, uh, settlement points, it's like 15 or something like that, uh, the settlement points that have a uh, settlement, let's say, settlement that has a uh, exit dating because of the excavation that took place on this uh, site. Uh, there are burial sites, but only in this southern cluster. There is no other burial sites on the terrain, which is Mm, pretty uh, usual for, for, for a Latin culture uh, settlement situation. And they are very uh, young I mean, from the first phases of, of, of the settlement process from Latin B. Uh, so this is some, some sort of information that is important. Uh, in also in the southern uh, cluster, there is a, a huge settlement, Nova Tzerekia 4, which was ex actually ex excavated. It was very rich in uh, archaeological objects and uh, also the coins. There, are, there is a very big, very big collection of, of, of Celtic coins from out there. But on the other side, there are also evidence of a very uh, uh, 
young uh, settlement, but not in the uh, southern cluster, but in the northeastern cluster. So we have a situation that um, in the southern cluster we have the, the youngest uh, burial sites, so let's say sepulchral sites. Um, also, this indicates to the Nova Selectia um, settlement because of the of this uh, burial object. Also, we have this, probably the situation when we have the the, the first uh, signs of settlement in the north uh, eastern uh, cluster. Uh, there are similarity in, for example, ceramics and uh, uh, artifacts with the terrain of Moravia, so south from from Poland, and partly uh, from the Czech uh, Republic, but in this uh, area. So is such an influence and such an influence here. Uh, so uh, there are hypotheses. Uh, the general hypothesis is which I could say that this, the process of settlement has was some kind of diffusional. If we see the, the dispersal of, of dispersal of the um, settlement elements. Uh, um, excuse me. Uh, um, the other uh, theory uh, is that the settlement process was very rapid. So there was quick uh, process of occupation of, of, this, uh, of this area. And that's just, this is uh, uh, hypothesis that it was a very fusional, slow process from the, uh, from the directions where the, the satellites could, could just come. So this is like very opposite uh, hypothesis. Uh, of course, the, the, we can say that there was an interaction between the natural resources, natural environment, and the whole process it was a dependence. There was a dependence uh, between those uh, process, those features. I mean, process, uh, and uh, the scientists, the archaeologists, uh, points that the first uh, settlement activities was uh, connected with the southern cluster, southern uh, um, area of, of this settlement. Uh, and the linkage with the arrival of the Celtic uh, people from Moravia, from south, and possibly from, um, from a Czech uh, basin, the Bohemian basin in, in the north and non, in north. Uh, so uh, the objectives of this research was to, uh, like I already said, recreation of, of this process, uh, to examine, I, examine the um, conditions uh, accompanying the, uh, the, the development of, of, of this settlement um, structure, uh, and to see what is the degree of, of dependencies between this process and the natural uh, environment. Um, and also, there was a possible there was possibility to observe how, why, what, what, what is the um, rational be behind that structure of of of, of the of the settlement. Uh, so uh, very quickly, the sources were the actually the points on the map uh, gathered in uh, uh, in. Uh, me, heritage protection offices in, in, in Poland and uh, in the Czech Republic, all the possible cartographic sources, and uh, also uh, field verification and some aerial uh, prospection. So here we can uh, see the, the area of this. Um, project. 
it's very uh, I'd say very good for 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 the settlers it has very good soils in, in, the, in the middle uh, there are good places uh, in the uh, river uh, plains like the uh, Ultra River here and uh, pretty flat areas here in, 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 uh, in the north. Uh, what you can also see here is the limitation of, of, the, of the area I, uh, area I was, uh, I was um, taking into consideration. The, the border here is, is, is the um, 370 meters above the uh, sea level where the, behind this uh, elevation there is no evidence of Celtic settlement so I just uh, throw it away. In general, there is a the the, the settlement. The, this area uh, consists of, of area that was occupied by the Celts, but also that has a natural uh, borders of the best quality of 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 uh, mm, of the settlement land. Let's say uh, here you can see the. Uh, the paths that were uh, simulated by the, I mean the, the results of the short uh, path derived from the coast distance raster. So we have a simulation of three possible point of enters for the for the settlers, and the simulation was made in the way that uh, lost low cost distance was uh, provided to the uh, geometrical center of the whole area because we have no evidence how could they get in, into this uh, area. This is a uh, Odra River uh, valley which might be the, the best way. This is also a part of the uh, Amber Route which was uh, very important in this time of the Celtic occupation settlement. Uh, so there was a uh, the whole area consisted of 320, 3,223 uh, cells, um, the nation of one uh, square kilometers, and also there was a pretty simplified net uh, of uh, calculation points for, for the other uh, uh, model. Mm. So the whole uh, area is considered uh, as a natural environment, if we say about natural environment, as a present state because there are no uh, uh, evidence, uh, paleobotanic evidence connected to Celtic. Uh, time of Celtic uh, uh, occupation of, of those uh, terrains so uh, so the, the the natural environment was, must have been uh, taken into consideration in, in this present state which in some parts is not so far from reality because uh, uh, for example the climate it wasn't so far from, from the from the mm, nowadays uh, climate, so there must be this uh, conclusion that we do this on this mm, present state. Uh, here we have a uh, table of valorization of uh, three or four uh, natural environment components, which we were, which I was uh, considering. So it was the, uh, the soil types, the best soil types. Mm, the river uh, net, the river accessibility, and also uh, slope aspect and uh, uh, slope uh, degree. All, mm, all those features had the same quality of, 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 of points. So because I didn't want to um, emphasize any of these of this, uh, uh, features, so we are talking about the best soils in the way that uh, 
Evla cell has the, the biggest area of, of, uh, of good cells. The, 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 it has a uh, higher rank, higher um, valuation. So it looked like that. This is the best cells, as I told you. The central part is, is, is pretty good. The blue uh, color is, is the four point cells. Uh, this is uh, the accessibility of water, slope grade, uh, and uh, uh, slope, slope aspect. Southern and Eastern is the, uh, the best uh, directions for the, for the, mm -hmm. for agri for the agriculture. Uh, so the mm, method, mm, there were two model, simulation model used. Uh, the intervening opportunity model. Uh, this is the model that um, uh, models the human decisions for uh, um, settlement, which is uh, which it has basis in the human demand for the uh, best settlement conditions. In this model, this demand more or less sharp is managed by the selectivity parameter. Uh, um, this model mechanism of decision uh, is based on the apparatus of uh, Bernoulli trial. And the attractivity of terrain features increases the probability of, uh, uh, of uh, settlement occurrence in the particular spot or, or, or area. The other uh, one was the UNC model, the probabilistic model for the initial growth using a Monte Carlo procedure. Uh, is the model that uh, consists that development of structures uh, is, uh, is a consequence of, of priming and secondary decisions. Priming decisions are, for example, the natural environment features, and the secondary decisions are made, let's say, uh, by the Monte Carlo uh, procedures. Both models are, were used in geography and the uh, spatial planning, so it's more with the, connected with the urban uh, area, but it, it, it has good uh, results in, in this uh, area, so I want to implicate it in, in this uh, section. So the first stage of the modeling with the interpreting uh, opportunity model brings uh, the situation when, the, when we have a uh, creation of some sort of center. And there you can see uh, this, the, the areas where, where the center was actually modeled. Those six uh, pictures shows the different uh, types of, of uh, natural environment taken into consider consideration. So, uh, and the uh, direction from, the, from which uh, the settle, settle sys uh, process was, was modeled uh, is uh, from here north, uh, uh, northern west, Mm, here is uh, our result from for the direction uh, mm, from one of the south direction. After uh, that, we can we can observe a another stage. So the dispersal of the of the uh, settlement more it's more maybe more uh, accurate to see the dispersal of the possibilities of acceptance of this. Uh, of this terrain. So we can uh, observe here a uh, accessibility of best soils. It also replicates a pretty good the real situation, but it's very, very clustered. Uh, here are the um, accessibility of water. Very, very poor uh, representation of, of the model and the similarity. And the best soils and uh, accessibility to water. It is all very uh, good replication of, of, of this uh, of this process. Here are some um, uh, correlations between the edge histograms of rows and columns between the model and the real structures. It has pretty good uh, outcomes, but we have to remember that it's it's. Uh, are the columns and not the real structure better. 
it has some uh, so some uh, gives some ex, um, expression and how, how, how this was uh, replicated. This is the UNC model uh, results. Uh, some variants of, of this model which were not actually very good at replicating the structure, especially when we're talking about uh, uh, starting simulation points from the edges of the uh, area. What we can observe then is when we started the starting points on this uh, clustering points from the first stage of the opportunity, uh, intervening opportunity models, situation uh, changes. And uh, here are some, um, some results, pretty, pretty good, but also this is the column um, correlation. Uh, so conclusion, uh, this, uh, the natural environment affects the, the, the process. I mean, there is a, uh, uh, some, some um, coordination in, in, in this, in between the environment and the, in the process. Uh, the whole settlement process is complex. It's not so, it's not so easy. It's not so, uh, um, it's complicated. Uh, mm, so it wasn't done by the hom some uh, homogeneous uh, uh, diffusion. Uh, there was some sort of, you might say that Mahler shows that there was some, some sort of striding diffusion. Uh, uh, the, the most close patterns, settlement patterns, are in connection with this uh, centers, with this, yeah, <laughs> with this uh, um, center points that were from this first uh, stages. So uh, that's conclusion which I was actually talking about. So the interpretation of the model, uh, so the, the best results were from the south, so probably the, the settlers come from the from the south, south was uh, done in two stages. So one uh, rapid, first stage rapid and quick in, in time, but probably uh, it was uh, mm, with uh, in connection with some uh, uh, earlier reconnaissance of, 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 of the whole terrain. And then after uh, establishing this, uh, let's say, ruling center or something, something like that, which is hard to um, interpret. Uh, in relation to this area, it was a, then it was a pretty uh, slow dispersal of the, of the um, settlement uh, components, which we know from the uh, present state, which is what, what is very uh, important that the best results were always when the, this ruling point was in the southern, uh, cluster, southern, um, where we have the, the, uh, the earliest evidence with the settlement and also where this Lovatsarekta uh, site is. So it's how to uh, put it into archaeological meaning, meaning it's, it's a question of, of, of the interpretation. It's, it's, it's model results and, and uh, real reality, but it, and in my opinion, it also has some, something to do with the reality and with the hypotheses and the theories that are behind this settlement process. Uh, thank you very much. The only one word at the, the end. Uh, I'm, <laughs> I'm,